Hi, my name is Cassie, and today we're talking about how college students spend money. Now, college students typically don't have much disposable income, so it's important for anyone to be wise about how they spend money. And with students' loans, credit card debt, and anticipated unanticipated costs after graduating, college students can easily find themselves deep in debt before they even apply for a job. According to a recent survey of 750 college graduates, the graduating class of 2013 owed on average $35,200 in college-related debt. The bulk of that debt is from government loans, owing $26,000 on average. But the class of 2013 also owed an average of $3,000 in credit card debt. Many of the graduates surveyed were shocked by the amount of debt they racked up during college. The number of graduates reporting surprised by the level of student debt they had accumulated is a big concern and shows that there is a considerable need for families to better understand the total cost of college, said Keith Bernardet. Time and time again, college graduates say they wish they had saved more and spent less in college. Some of the thing, things college students spend money on is room and board, a big expense is paying the college for that room and board. On average, students will spend about $20,000 over their college career. So they say it's important to focus on finding the cheaper dorm rooms on campus, not spending so much on things for your dorm room, and also taking advantage of the opportunities they have on campus, like the cafeteria, free entertainment, that kind of stuff. Another thing that college students spend money on is spring break trips. And sometimes they get really, really elaborate, and it can cost a couple thousand dollars depending on where you go. And so instead of spending so much money on those spring break trips during your college years, maybe save up and then take it while you're out of college when you have the money to pay for it. Last but not least, some of the things that college students spend money on is their supplies. Tuition, or not tuition, their textbooks, their computers, general stuff like that. Some kids spend up to $1,000 on a new computer. They'll buy brand new textbooks from the bookstore and that stuff can get really pricey when there's a lot of opportunities through Amazon or little bookstores buying, bookstores off campus I should say, buying from other students, renting, little things like that that can help you save a little bit more money and not spend it so much while you're in college. College can be a tricky time, and saving money or earning money can be really difficult, yet spending money can be the easiest. So it's always important to focus on what you are spending your money on, and yes, it's important to give yourself a little bit so that you can spend, but not, working so, not spending so much that you end up in a lot of debt. So that's all I have for on how college students spend their money. Have a great day.